Mayorkas said today Pennsylvania Governor Wolf dis responded to a federal judge's ruling that said his pandemic shutdown orders were unconstitutional. He says the decision will be appealed, but what does all of this mean and what happens next? We talked to a lawyer about the judge's ruling. Here's First News reporter Jacob Thompson. Back in the beginning of March, Governor Tom Wolf imposed restrictions to prevent the spread of COVID-19. But in May, four western Pennsylvania counties sued the governor, coming together for a similar argument. I think part of their argument was that you can't paint with a broad brush that, that um, you know, the emergency may be of the same magnitude in some counties as it is in others. The court later decided to only have four individuals represent each of the four counties, dismissing the counties as a whole. But yesterday, Judge William Stickman called the state's orders unconstitutional even though he acknowledged the decisions were made within the best intentions. What uh, Judge Stickman said is that it's overly broad. Citing the 14th Amendment, equal protection of the laws. Decisions with regard to what's essential and what's non-essential seems to contravene equal protection. Adding the First Amendment, freedom of assembly. Even in times of an emergency, we can't relax our vigilance with regard to our individual rights. But earlier today, Governor Tom Wolf pushed back against the ruling, saying he plans to appeal, which means he could ask for a stay. So if they get a stay, then his order is not going to be enforceable. His order that's saying that the governor acted unconstitutionally will not be, uh, you know, will not apply until the appellate court makes a decision on that. Which could take months if the courts decide to fast track the case. In Newcastle, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.